Hi guys, welcome. Today we are going to be making some Kasvia's um, stool or um, gang kilik. Okay, uh, this is imported from Laos. Um, it's fresh, so you could get one in a can at the um, your Asian local store. Um, what we have that we're going to be using is lemongrass, ginger, cauliflower lime leaf. We have some onions that we're going to be using. Okay, uh, we the key, key ingredients would be yanang. This is also called bamboo grass leaf. I already blend everything up, so you just blend it with water. Um, yanang, and then we have kabura. Okay, it's um, sticky rice. You soak that, and then you just crush it with like um. Pepper, and then you use the mortar and the the pestle to do that, and then just add a little bit of water. So when it goes into the stew or the soup, it doesn't clunk up. Um, we're gonna be using pork meat on our soup, and then uh, and then we're gonna be using this roasted buffalo skin. Um, it is uh, nang kim, okay. And then after that, we're going to be topping it off with some um, green onions. And then let's get started. Okay guys, so here I have a pot of water. We're going to cook our meat first. So we're going to throw in the for lime leaf, okay, the lemongrass, our ginger. Okay, we're gonna put a little bit on. We're gonna see if this were um, later. Okay, so that's what we want. This is start cooking or simmers. We're gonna do that on a high heat. See the pot starts to simmer. Okay, so I'm gonna season it with a little bit of salt. Okay, on the meat. Okay, now we're gonna stir this up. We're gonna wait until it cooks thoroughly, and then we're gonna put um, the rest of the stuff down on here. Going to add our yanang broth or the bamboo grass broth that we blended up. So go ahead and add that in there. Okay, get everything in there. We're going to add our cassavia leaf that we blended up. Okay, and we're going to let we're going to stir it very well and we're going to let it simmer for about 15 minutes. Okay? Oh, okay, let's add our roasted buffalo skin or the grind. Then we're gonna stir it thoroughly, then we're gonna leave it for about 15 minutes, okay?
Okay, so once it starts to broil, right guys, we are going to put in our kalpuda, okay, the one that um, we put a little bit of pepper on. And then once you put this on, make sure you stir very often, otherwise the starch is going to go and stay down on the bottom of your, your pot. But you don't want that on your stool. So once this goes in, stir from the bottom up. Okay. For a couple minutes and then you want to close it. And then in a couple more minutes, you come back and stir. So once that starts to boil, see that? We're gonna turn the heat down to medium. Then we're gonna season it, okay? We're gonna be using the anchovies or fermented fish sauce. I remember I already put like, um, I already seasoned the, uh, the, the meat with the salt, so we're not gonna put a lot of this on, okay? But you could add it to taste. Add it to taste. Then we're gonna add um, the chicken flavor broth or granulated uh, chicken flavor base. This pan, okay. Um, you could also add crushed pepper if you want, um, but I already add that with the with the rice base that I add um, in before. So that should be good. Some people like it spicy and they do add extra spice on here. Then we're gonna let it simmer for about another 10 to 20 minutes so it cooks. Then we're gonna add more of the for lime leaves for the um, flavoring and then the onions. Um, then we're gonna taste it. It should be flavorful and savory that's how it's it's supposed to be um, back at home. So gankilik, okay, or okilik in this case. Okay. That look good. Okay. Starting to cook. This is our nangua. The buffalo, the roasted, um, salted um, buffalo skin. Alright, so it's been almost 45 minutes. Um, it's pretty much done. We're gonna add the rest of our ingredients in there, which is the onions. It brings out the flavor and um, it enhances the, the taste. So we're gonna put that in there. We're gonna let it sit for like about a minute before we turn off our stove okay might want to give it a little stir then we're gonna add the green onions in there and then you could also do the final tasting before you turn off your stove make sure you get it to how you like to like it um, savory, deep, it should be rich. It's gonna be um, bitter because it's constantly a um, stew. So, after that, we're gonna turn it with um, green onions, okay? Just like that. enhance the taste the smell it should be very savory um, how you make ganky lake if you have like um, kaimot then you could also put it in there but we don't so <laughs> but this is good enough okay look at nang mua. so this is how you want it it cooks for about like 45 minutes Okay, I'm gonna put this on a bowl and then we'll take a picture for you guys. And then we'll taste it. 
Thank you for watching. Okay, let's taste it, guys. Open the sad ball. Look at this. Mmm. Okay, see Mmm. เอาหนังนี่สดกับหอมโอ้เป็นกระแซบเป็นกระแซบอืมทราย cooking this is so good thank you for watching come back